team, as a manufacturer, to win the championship and call yourself world champion, it, it's an official, um, you know, it's an official status, which is really important. And for the drivers as well, it means a lot. So yeah, we can't wait for this first year. As a driver, it doesn't really make any difference because the competition is hard and it's been hard from the beginning. But clearly, you know, you cannot say that you won the world championship before. Uh, it was an FIA championship. Now it is a world championship, so it gives a little bit of something special. Campeonato de Fórmula E já era um campeonato mundial desde a temporada 3, é, temporada 2, porque já tinha três montadoras, já tinha três continentes que a gente fazia o campeonato. Na Fórmula E já é um campeonato mundial. To be officially recognized as such is is, is absolutely uh, absolutely deserved. Um, so it's great to, to have made that step. Just shows how far this championship uh, came already, and uh, I hope I can call myself uh, world champion one day. For everyone involved in the ecosystem, it shows the progression and the continued progression of Formula E as a championship. That's exciting for the for the teams, for the manufacturers, for the drivers, for everyone involved. So giving us even more to look forward to in when when we do well. This is uh, for sure positive uh, for all the people working here, engineers, mechanics, drivers, uh, definitely something uh, positive here. The level is very high, with all the pilots very strong, it's a good thing for everyone. We are representing the future of the future. Push, 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 push! Yes, yes! Oh man, I never had so much adrenaline!